Firstly, detangle your human hair wig using either your fingers, a normal brush or a comb. Avoid using wire wig brushes as these can damage the wig. Once your wig is not free, squeeze human hair wig shampoo into a bowl of lukewarm water and mix it in with your hands to ensure the solution has dissolved. Then place the wig in the bowl and rub the shampoo into the crown of the wig and inside the wig cap. Let the wig soak in water for a couple of minutes. You can also soak and wash your wig in a sink following the same techniques. Gently rinse the product off your human hair wig by running it under a tap, keeping the hair running in the same direction. To encourage the solution to come off, use your fingers to manoeuvre the hairs so that the water reaches all parts of the wig, but try not to create any tangles. Make sure you refill your bowl with clean, lukewarm water before you begin the conditioning process. Once refilled, pour the conditioner into the bowl and mix the water with your hands until the conditioner solution has dissolved. Put your wig into the bowl and rub the conditioner into the ends of the hair strands. Then let the wig soak for a couple of minutes. Just like you did with the shampoo, return your wig to under the tap and allow the water to rinse off any remaining conditioner. The water tends to do most of the work, so you don't have to fiddle with the wig itself too much. Again, dab your wig softly with a towel until it's slightly drier and no longer dripping. Then secure your wig onto a wig stand or polystyrene head and begin gently brushing the hair with a comb to get rid of all the knots. Start from the bottom upwards and once finished, leave it to dry naturally and make sure it stays out of direct sunlight to avoid damage. We find by using a suction wig clamp holder and a polystyrene styling head or a wig stand, it makes the drying process much easier as it ensures the wig stays in one place and encourages it to dry back to its natural style.